Hello and welcome back to Matthew's Tottenham blog and to another breaking transfer news video and the story tonight is that Serge Aurier could potentially be on the move. Now before I get into that, if you do want more breaking transfer news videos and transfer talk live streams, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and click the notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload. Now the story tonight is coming from football.london in an exclusive to them uh, a feature on their website that certainly tends to be very reliable, especially when it comes from Tottenham and especially when it comes from Alistair Gold as this story does. And the story is that AC Milan are weighing up a £15 million bid uh, to try and tempt Serge Aurier away from Tottenham. Uh, according to Alistair Gold, Tottenham will uh, seemingly hold out for about £25 million if and when a bid is launched. Now, it's no secret that Serge Aurier um, isn't exactly happy in North London. He made it clear last summer that he, he, would, uh, he was open to a move away from the club and this could potentially be... Um, and out for him you know since he signed from PSG he hasn't been the player that we wanted he hasn't, he hasn't really been the player that we needed he's a very rash and uh, not skillful defender I suppose now since Mourinho has come in and he's been played in a more advanced role he has certainly improved uh, but that is why I think this deal is one that will certainly divide the Spurs fan base as to whether or not it is one that we should consider um, personally I'm, I'm torn on this one I'm not sure if I do want him to go uh, in, in that attacking role he has certainly been a lot better he had a really good game against uh, against Liverpool at the weekend and it's maybe the inconsistency in his performances is something that will be kind of pushing me towards being happy that he, he may be leaving the club but uh, as it stands no bid has been made just yet but um, AC Milan could be about to launch a £15 million offer for Serge Aurier uh, now what does this mean for Tottenham's transfer plans we heard very early on in the window from Sky Sports and a number of other sources that Tottenham are planning on being reactive rather than proactive in this window and that has certainly held true up until now. If you look at the injury suffered by Musa Sissoko, he's out until April and Tottenham have immediately moved for Jetson Fernandez, uh, a, a deal that could be announced in the, in the next 24 hours. I wouldn't be surprised if it is announced tonight. Um, and another one, Harry Kane being injured and now according to the Independent, uh, Mourinho wants not one but two strikers, one of which we assume is Christ Christoph Piantek from AC Milan. Um, but that move, uh, those rumours seem to have died down in the last couple of days. But as for potential replacements for Serge Aurier, uh, since last summer, it's been uh, right back has been subject to a lot of rumours as, as for players that Tottenham are potentially looking into. The big ones in the summer were Elsie Husa, Yusuf Atal, and Max Irons. Irons being one that has continued on into this window with Sky Sports reporting that uh, Tottenham have a, a major interest in him, and if they are to sign a right back, he would be the number one target. Uh, now it is apparent that Norwich want a thirty million pound fee for him but they're unlikely to let him leave in this window as they attempt to stave off relegation from the Premier League. Another player Tottenham are looking into is Nordi Mukiele, who plays with uh, Orbi Leipzig in the Bundesliga, but that's one that's not as likely, and it's not one personally that I'd expect to go through. Uh, the interest in Husay and Atal from the summer seems to have died down. Uh, potentially they were uh, Pochettino targets and Mourinho was looking for someone different. Uh, again, Max Ahrens seemingly the number one target uh, if we do need to sign a right back. But... It's, uh, I wouldn't say it's surprising news. Again, you know, Aurier hasn't had the best of times in North London. He's been, I think, two and a half years since we signed him. Uh, but AC Milan could be a really good move for him. They're a side who are struggling for form, sitting 13th in the Serie A um, at the moment. And, you know, it could be a good move for him going to a league that's certainly not as, as good as the Premier League. Um, but it, it remains to be seen whether or not, first of all, whether or not AC Milan will actually launch that bid. And then uh, are Tottenham willing to sell? And if so, can a deal be agreed because there's a, a, a discrepancy there of about £10 million of the two clubs valuation of the player but uh, breaking news from football.london tonight is that AC Milan are weighing up a £15 million bid for Serge Aurier.